right, so let's get started. So just get yourself in a comfortable position for the meditation. Some people will do this sitting down. Other people prefer to lay down. Either is absolutely fine. And as you find a comfortable position, just take a couple of nice deep breaths into your body. Breathe into your heart. Breathe all the way in. And then exhale. With each breath, just let yourself relax a little more deeply, a little more profoundly. And just let go of any thoughts or experiences from the day in your mind. Just let yourself relax deeply into the experience. And as you bring your focus on your heart center, you can imagine in this space a beautiful light that begins to develop. You see that the energy in the heart center starts to glow. And there's a beautiful luminosity sending light from the heart center. And it's a light that begins to radiate through your body, through all the cells in your body, all the way to the skin surface and into the space around your body, creating this beautiful radiant field of light emanating from the heart center. And you may notice little shifts of energy within your body, little vibrations or movements of energy. This is all very natural to the process. And we'll take a moment to become aware of our connection to the earth, just through your feet and through your lower energy centers. Feel the connection that we each hold to the planet, the Gaia, to the energy grids of Gaia, the crystalline grid of Gaia. And feel our connection to the sacred elemental forces, the earth, the fire, the air, the water. We just take a moment to commune in gratitude and awareness. And as this happens, we'll notice a beautiful energy begins to flow into our body and our auric field. And it again just enhances the energy vibration within our energy system. And the frequency of the energy begins to increase. And you may palpably notice this with little vibrations in your body, the energy centers in your body, in your hands, your feet, your crown. And as the energy in our system enhances in this way, we become aware of the higher energy centers. And just imagine the top of your energy body, your crown chakra begins to open like a beautiful lotus or flower. And there's a radiant light that shines from this space. And there's a column of light that forms extending from well high above the body, down through the body, and all the way down below us into the center of the earth. And through the upper energy centers, you can feel a connection to your guides, your higher self, The star families, beings of light from other civilizations, the creator. And as this energy connection also strengthens, you begin to flow, feel a flow of energy down into your body from above. And again, just allow yourself to receive this energy. Like a gentle rain of energy down over and through your body. Just let the energy merge into your body like water into the soil. And as the energy adjusts, you again will notice the energy in your system begins to vibrate. 
or increase in frequency. And we just take a moment here to allow the energy to adjust. And then as the energy is working with each one of us in this way, You'll notice a sense of buoyancy that begins to develop within your energy, within your body. And you begin to feel like you're lifting in space. You stay connected to your physical body, but like a hot air balloon, you gently lift in consciousness and energy above the body, moving upwards and upwards. And as you're floating up in consciousness, we come together as a group in a quantum room, a space in energy. It's above time and physical reality. And in this space, we come together and we find ourselves taking the form of sitting in a circle. And as the energy of each person finds its way to this space and we come together in union in this way, you can feel as the group gathers, there's an enhancement of energy, an empowerment of energy. The frequency or the energy begin, becomes very, very high in vibration. You may even register this in your physical body through vibratory changes in your hands or feet. And as we merge into a circle, a beautiful torus of energy forms around the group, spinning around the group. And as we sit in this field of spinning energy, just allow yourself to receive from this space that which serves your highest good, your highest potential your healing, your personal development. Just let the energy support you and lift you at this moment. And as we hold our position in the circle, if we gaze upward very gently, we can see forming above the group a geometric structure of light. It's a golden pyramid made of a translucent light with four sides and a square base, and it's spinning very, very gently in the space above the group. And as the structure takes form at the apex of the pyramid, like a burning star, the energy becomes very, very vibrant. And we can see waves or oscillations of light moving down over the sides of the translucent pyramid. The light is filled with many frequencies, iridescent colors of red through purple, green and blue, but translucent and transparent as it's moving down over the sides of the pyramid. We can appreciate the quantum or multidimensional nature of this light. And as the light moves through the pyramid, the pyramid comes to life, it begins to vibrate. And a beautiful field of energy forms within the pyramid, the center of the pyramid. And it's a radiant ball of light made of a white, silver, iridescent light with little rainbow fractals of hue all through its structure. And it grows stronger and stronger and stronger. And as the energy develops, this ball of light in the pyramid begins to descend as if moving down an axis into the middle of the group. And it's 
hovering in this space, shining and sending light and radiation of energy out in all directions. And as the light takes form in the center in this way, you may feel this energy moving through your body as it moves outward. And we just pause here for a moment to receive again from this energy. Just to let this energy work with us individually and collectively to enhance the energy of our energy system and to prepare us for the energy of the transmission. This is an interdimensional light, a healing light, a nurturing light. Just let yourself again receive from this light that which serves your highest good your highest potential, your greatest healing. And forming at the apex of the pyramid, we can see another ball of quantum light, a beautiful silvery blue and white light and it forms a glowing ball, the very apex of the pyramid. And as the light touches the apex of the pyramid, it cascades down over the pyramid, forming a ring of light that moves down through the group, forming a circle just at the outer perimeter of the group. And as the light stabilizes here behind the group, from this space, there is a being of light that emerges behind each person, a familiar energy in these monthly transmissions, the Syrian beings. And as they stand behind us, each one of us in the circle, they simply raise their hand, their right hand over your head, the left hand behind your heart. And as they take this position and hold this posture, you can feel the supportive presence that they bring to the experience of this meditation and transmission. They're simply holding your energy while you integrate in a natural way the process, the transmission. And as they hold our energy field in this posture, you can feel within your own energy system an enhancement of light. And you'll notice that the light in each and every one of your chakras begins to develop and radiate. There's a beautiful light shining from each and every energy center in the body creating a field or a lattice work of energy through the body. The energy centers below the feet, the soul star and the, of the earth star and above the body, the soul star. All of these energy centers become very, very alive and shining with light. And there's a core axis of energy running down through your body from well above your body or below your body, creating a pillar or column of light. And the light at the center of the circle begins to pulse, sending energy outward. And with each successive wave of energy moving through the group, you can feel the energy in your own system enhancing, supported inside and outside. And you begin to glow brighter. There's an intensity of light that develops. And as the light grows stronger through the axis of your body, through the energy centers in your body, 
A beautiful field of iridescent, multicolored light forms all around your body. And holding this energy, we begin to visualize or see in energy a helix of energy that exists around the body. And as our vibration is enhanced in this way, we become capable of seeing or experiencing this energy in a more direct and personal way. And as the energy pulses through our energy system, the helix becomes more visible above and below the body. And as we look upward, we can see a helix that extends all the way up far beyond our level of vision. Understanding it seeds itself all the way back to the center of the galaxy. And below us, we can feel this helix moving down through the layers of the earth, touching the crystalline core of the earth. And the energy within this helix grows brighter and stronger. And at the upper element of the helix, we can imagine a point where the helix touches a geometry. And the geometry is like a disc enclosed made with internal triangles forming a Sri Yantra pattern of light. And it's a beautiful golden white light. And it's shining and radiating very, very brightly. And as we focus more on this structure, it becomes stronger in its intensity and radiation. And it begins to send energy down through the axis of the DNA. And inferiorly towards the center of the earth, again, we see a beautiful interlocking series of triangles in the form of a geometry, pulsing light all the way up through the axis of the DNA. And as the helix is held at upper and lower points by these geometries, it's pulsing light all throughout every twist and spiral of the helix. And the structure becomes luminous, brilliant with light. And the energy converges at the heart center in your body. And holding this posture, there are little pulsations of light that begin to develop within your heart. With each pulse of light, it's sending a stronger and stronger field of light around your body. And the light within the helix from above, from below, and from within, all merge within the helical structure. And as the light moves in gentle waves through the helix, you can feel it touching a network of channels within the helix, little nexus points of energy. And as the light traverses these nexus points of energy and space, you can feel them being touched or catalyzed by the pulsing light. And the light moves through these little filaments, these little array of lights, lines of light. And we're going to pause for a moment, just allowing the light to work through the structure of the helix. There's nothing to do here, just relax into the experience and let the light work 
with the innate wisdom it carries. And in an interesting way, you may feel yourself as if you're melting into this energy, being fully immersed in this energy. Just let yourself feel it, be aware of the energy. Nothing to do, just let the energy work with its own natural wisdom. And the energy begins to coalesce within your body, forming a beautiful space of energy all around your spinal cord. From the lowest part of your spine, your sacrum, all the way up through the lumbar spine in your back, lower back, your thoracic spine in your chest, the cervical spine in your neck, and the skull at the top of your body. And just let the light embrace these structures, moving gently. Around these structures and just let your nervous system adjust to the frequency of the energy. Just feel the love and the healing intensity within the energy. Just let your body absorb the energy and the experience. Let your nervous system be bathed in this energy. Here, we're just going to pause for a few moments just to allow the energy to work with each person in an individual way. You can imagine in your own experience the light is penetrating into the tissues of your body, into the energy fabric of your body, nursing this whole column of energy of your spine with radiant light. And holding the energy in this way, we begin to experience a sequence of pulses, a beautiful light radiating down through the axis of the helix, sending wave after wave of gentle oscillations of energy, pulses of energy that are recalibrating the energetic space within the helix of the 24th chromosome. And as our body is nursed in the energy, we become more attuned to the energy within the helix. And as the intensity of the energy enhances, we feel the groundedness of being connected to the earth and the sacred elements. And we can feel our ability to hold this energy in this healing experience by the strength of our connection to the earth. We'll just allow the energy to work very gently. In an incredibly nurturing in affirmative way. And you'll feel within your body as if you're holding a higher frequency, a higher energy within the physical and energetic structure of your body.
and the beings of light behind us in the meditation hold their posture and a ring of light forms connecting their third eye as an entire group forming a beautiful ring of brilliant blue white light spinning around the circle just at the outer periphery of the circle and as the light oscillates and moves in this way we can feel a communication a message that's sent through the Syrian beings this transmission Greetings, dear ones. We join you at the threshold of another adventure as we embark upon year six of the transmissions. holding the space to ignite the flame of ascension and receive pulsed transmissions in the 24th chromosome. You see, dear ones, the ascension journey is progressing and rapidly accelerating on your planet. You may be aware that you are moving into new energetic fields of light, cosmic or galactic fields of light, and you are receiving codes and calibrations through the flow of energy from this galactic space. You have been prepared. You have been prepared to begin receiving these codes and frequencies with safety and healing power. As you move forward in the paradigm of ascension, you are beginning to integrate these energies in a profound and remarkable way. And your body is being prepared to receive even higher frequencies of light and consciousness. This is a process which culminates in the integration of your divinity. An awareness of your origin in the Creator's light. We begin this year's cycle with an awareness of changes that are taking place within the structure of the 24th chromosome. Before you see, dear ones, as you conceptualize the potential of changes that arrive with the ascension, it is difficult to manifest these visions and awarenesses without the energetic integration that would lead to this success. The power of this transformation lies within the access to spirit you hold through the structure of your quantum 24th chromosome. This provides a direct connection between your higher dimensional 
nature, your I am presence, and the physical incarnation in which you dwell at this moment in time. We have begun to introduce the concept of integration of lifetimes that is occurring within this 24th chromosomal enhancement. For you see, dear ones, that this ascension experience is occurring in a single lifetime in a multidimensional experience. And as the veil of awareness is removed in this single lifetime, it also begins to efface itself in a quantum way in all other incarnational experiences encoded within your DNA system. As this occurs, you become not only aware of other incarnational experiences. You become aware of the wisdom and the knowledge and the essence of all of these experiences simultaneously in time. For you see as a soul incarnate on earth, you are a composition of all of these experiences. And there is an incredible wisdom that has been garnered through these various incarnational moments. As you learn to bring together this energy within the construct of a single incarnation, you realize that all of these experiences are alive within you simultaneously. This is not to be confusing, but to simplify an understanding of the process which will bring you to the experience of wisdom beyond the rationale of this incarnational experience. You see, dear ones, many of you are beginning to remember gifts and talents and abilities that you carry within your genetic memory, but manifest more clearly in other points of incarnation. As you learn to draw this energy into your experience, it brings with it an awakening power and potential. For you see, dear ones, the wisdom of the ages lies within you. This is a time of awakening, an awakening to the memory of your essential nature. And as you begin to awaken to this memory, you begin to understand in a living way the essence of your own being and the creator's light. Each and every human being is seated with the consciousness of divine love and wisdom. And as you integrate higher dimensional aspects of energy and consciousness, you become more and more a living manifestation of this essence. 
the journey upon which we embark through this cycle is to support you in this attainment. To clarify any opacities in energy, any confusion, any restrictions that would hold you in the perception that this is not true. As you learn to integrate this energy and undergo the experience of this integration, you will understand that you hold within you great power. It is the power of love. In the myriad of meanings that these simple words hold, we celebrate this moment where we move beyond explanations and words and concepts toward integrated experiences. that become a living truth within you. The words are but catalysts for a natural process whose time has come. As you revel in the energies and the magic of these moments you share together, these precious moments we also share with you, we take pause just for a moment to honor you, to acknowledge you, to encourage you and to celebrate you. It is with great joy that we look forward to the journey ahead with you. And as we prepare to take leave in this moment, that we remind you, you are never alone. That together, through the light of the eternal sun, we are with you, dear family, for indeed we are one. Again, we pause for a moment just to integrate the energy of this experience. And as we observe the ring of light behind, it begins to coalesce into a radiant circle. And it begins to rise over the pyramid coalescing into a ball of light at the apex and moving upwards, becoming invisible in space. And 
And as we gaze to the center of the circle, we will see the quantum ball of energy at its position there, gently contract inwards, pulling itself in, and then expanding gently but powerfully in all directions. And you feel this energy as it moves in a pulse through your energy system. And as we bring our awareness to our own energy system, we can feel the expanded light around our form draw gently inwards to the heart. And we're bringing in this moment the memory, the awareness, the energy of this experience back into our heart center. And we'll hold this experience within the heart. And just breathe for a moment into this experience. Breathe into your body. Just holding this energy in this way. And the pyramid of light above the group begins to spin very gently. And simply vaporize into the space around. And we prepare in consciousness to move back into our physical bodies and gently you'll feel your energy begin to move downwards back into your physical body of form bringing with you the energy and consciousness of this experience back into your physical body And as we bring this powerful energy into the body, we allow a few moments for the integration. And you may want to stay in this meditative space for a little while. As we prepare to close the meditation, feel free to stay in this posture. And if you're ready to move out of the meditation, draw the energy to your body. You can wiggle your fingers and your toes just to help the physical integration of the energy. Breathe into your body, nice deep, deep breath into your body as if you're drawing the energy and experience into your physical body and into your cells. Just breathe inwards. Mm. Another breath in. When you're ready, you can open your eyes and come on back into the space. And we look forward to joining you next month as we come together to continue our journey. Pulsed transmissions in the 24th chromosome. And so it is. Namaste.